Hi! Welcome back to another mind-blowing video. Today we are visiting the National Park where more than 3 million visitors visited in 2022. It is the Yellowstone National Park. So let's go for it. Yellowstone National Park is an American national park located in the western United States, largely in the northwest corner of Wyoming and extending into Montana and Idaho. It was established by the 42nd U.S. Congress with the Yellowstone National Park Protection Act and signed into law by President Ulysses S. Grant on March 1, 1872. Yellowstone was the first national park in the U.S. and is also widely held to be the first national park in the world. The park is known for its wildlife and its many geothermal features, especially the Old Faithful Geyser, one of its most popular. While it represents many types of biomes, the subalpine forest is the most abundant. It is part of the South Central Rockies Forests ecoregion. Yellowstone National Park spans an area of 3,468.4 square miles, comprising lakes, canyons, rivers, and mountain ranges. Yellowstone Lake is one of the largest high-elevation lakes in North America and is centered over the Yellowstone Caldera, the largest supervolcano on the continent. The park is the centerpiece of the Greater Yellowstone Ecosystem, the largest remaining nearly intact ecosystem in the Earth's northern temperate zone. In 1978, Yellowstone was named a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Hundreds of species of mammals, birds, fish, reptiles, and amphibians have been documented, including several that are either endangered or threatened. The vast forests and grasslands also include unique species of plants. Yellowstone Park is the largest, and most famous megafauna location in the contiguous United States. Grizzly bears, wolves, and free-ranging herds of bison and elk live in this park. The Yellowstone Park Bison Herd is the oldest and largest public bison herd in the United States. In 1871, 11 years after his failed first effort, Ferdinand V. Hayden was finally able to explore the region. With government sponsorship, he returned to the region with a second, larger expedition, the Hayden Geological Survey of 1871. He compiled a comprehensive report, including large format photographs by William Henry Jackson and paintings by Thomas Moran. The report helped to convince the U.S. Congress to withdraw this region from public auction. On March 1, 1872, President Ulysses S. Grant signed the Act of Dedication Law that created Yellowstone National Park. By 1915, 1,000 automobiles per year were entering the park, resulting in conflicts with horses and horse-drawn transportation. Horse travel on roads was eventually prohibited. The Heritage and Research Center is located at Gardiner, Montana, near the north entrance to the park. The center is home to the Yellowstone National Park's museum collection, archives, research library, historian, archaeology lab, and herbarium. The Yellowstone National Park archives maintain collections of historical records of Yellowstone and the National Park Service. The collection includes the administrative records of Yellowstone, as well as resource management records, records from major projects, and donated manuscripts and personal papers. The archives are affiliated with the National Archives and Records Administration. Approximately 96% of the land area of Yellowstone National Park is located within the state of Wyoming. Another 3% is within Montana, with the remaining 1% in Idaho. The park is 63 miles north to south, and 54 miles west to east by air. Yellowstone is 2,219,789 acres in area, larger than either of the states of Rhode Island or Delaware. Rivers and lakes cover 5% of the land area, with the largest water body being Yellowstone Lake at 87,040 acres. Yellowstone Lake is up to 400 feet deep and has 110 miles of shoreline. At an elevation of 7,733 feet above sea level, Yellowstone Lake is the largest high-elevation lake in North America. Forests comprise 80% of the land area of the park, most of the rest is grassland. The Yellowstone Caldera is the largest volcanic system in North America, and worldwide it is only rivaled by the Lake Toba Caldera on Sumatra. It has been termed a supervolcano because the caldera was formed by exceptionally large explosive eruptions. The magma chamber that lies under Yellowstone is estimated to be a single connected chamber, about 37 miles long, 18 miles wide, and 3 to 7 miles deep. 
The current caldera was created by a cataclysmic eruption that occurred 640,000 years ago, which released more than 240 cubic miles of ash, rock and pyroclastic materials. This eruption was more than 1,000 times larger than the 1980 eruption of Mount St. Helens. It produced a caldera nearly 5 eighths of a mile deep and 45 by 28 miles in area and deposited the Lava Creek Tuff, a welded tuff geologic formation. The most violent known eruption, which occurred 2.1 million years ago, ejected 588 cubic miles of volcanic material and created the rock formation known as the Huckleberry Ridge Tuff and created the Island Park Caldera. A smaller eruption ejected 67 cubic miles of material 1.3 million years ago, forming the Henry's Fork Caldera and depositing the Mesa Falls Tuff. The most famous geyser in the park, and perhaps the world, is Old Faithful Geyser, located in Upper Geyser Basin. Castle Geyser, Lion Geyser, Beehive Geyser, Grand Geyser, the world's tallest predictable geyser, Giant Geyser, the world's most voluminous geyser, Riverside Geyser and numerous other geysers are in the same basin. The park contains the tallest active geyser in the world, Steamboat Geyser in the Norris Geyser Basin. A study that was completed in 2011 found that at least 1283 geysers have erupted in Yellowstone. Of these, an average of 465 are active in a given year. Yellowstone contains at least 10,000 thermal features altogether, including geysers, hot springs, mud pots, and fumaroles. Over half of the world's geysers and hydrothermal features are concentrated in Yellowstone. In May 2001, the U.S. Geological Survey, Yellowstone National Park, and the University of Utah created the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory YVO, a partnership for long-term monitoring of the geological processes of the Yellowstone Plateau Volcanic Field, for disseminating information concerning the potential hazards of this geologically active region. Wow we are almost end of the video. When you all going to visit the park let us know your experience through the comments. Hope you all like this video. Make sure to subscribe and click the bell icon so you never miss our latest videos.